guys, it is April from Breaking Up With Fat. Um, so I have decided to do something a little bit different with my YouTube channel. Obviously, I'll still be talking all about weight loss and helping you guys out there, um, but I'm also thinking of expanding it because, um, as you know, um, my brand is breaking up with fat, but it's also hooking up with happy. So I wanted to show you all of the things that make me happy. So for November, I thought that what I would do is kind of do a bit of a haul for you um, of stuff like beauty things that I found that I'm in love with, things that fill me with happiness that make me relaxed, and then obviously um, my wellness, um, mental and physical wellness, um, things that I've picked up recently that I'm just in love with. So I thought that I would start with the beauty. So I went to Sephora. I'm well little crazy. My cousin was in town for the weekend, which was so lovely. And we just, we kind of lost our minds. We went to Sephora. And that's what happens to every girl. That's what happens when you go. So the first thing I picked up, I'm so excited about this. It's Philosophy Eggnog Body Shower. Just shower gel. Um, it's the best stuff in the world. Let me get this out for you. Oh, woo. It's so good. It, it literally, this saves me. If you're dieting and you like eggnog um, in the winter and specifically in, um, why can't I open this? I'm strong now. Specifically in um, the like Christmas time, if you're feeling like eggnog, I swear to God, this will save you from buying eggnog and consuming large quantities of it. So nice to do on Christmas Eve, but you can have eggnog for like November, December, and it smells exactly, exactly like eggnog. I love it. I'm so happy about that. So eggnog, body wash. That's what I started with. And then um, I headed over to NARS. Um, and I needed um, a new highlighter. I had a highlighter before that was like, it was cream. And I just found, it was the Benefit um, highlighter. And it was okay, it was good, and I still have it, and I like it. But I just wanted something powder. I really like all things powder. So I went to NARS, well, to Sephora, and I got Albatross. So this is what Albatross looks like. I don't know if you can see that. It's not very easy to see in this light, I find, but it's it looks really gold. Um, but it's more of a shimmer. It's like a gold shimmer, but it just adds this nice sheen to your face. So you'd put it up like just right here on your um, cheekbone and then also just above um, your eyelid, like on your brow bone. And it just adds a little pop. Oh, and also another really nice place to put it is right in the corners of your eyes. It just adds this like luminous kind of feel for your look. So I like to use it, you know, I think you can use this day and night. You don't have to be waiting for something fancy. Just, it's just nice for winter because everything gets dull in the winter and it's good to like have some, some things that pop. So I got that. And then what else did I get at Sephora in particular? Another NARS. Um, I apparently just went crazy in the NARS section. I really wanted to get a um, a new blush that just felt nice for for winter. I have a really really bright pink blush right now, and I just wanted something a little more rosy, a little more maybe even plum. So um, I ended up going in and getting Oasis by Nars, and I've heard that it looks a lot. It actually does look a lot like um, Mahi Mahi, I think it's called, or Mari Mari. I don't know what it's called, something, one of those. But this one has shimmer to it. So I'll show you. It's um, it's just got a little tiny bit of shimmer. It's not overwhelming or anything like that. 
but I'll let you see. So it's you see how it's kind of, it's a rose. It's a lovely little rose blush. I really, really like it. I'm wearing it right now. It's not overwhelming when you first put it on. Um, you really don't need much. You just like kind of dab it with your blush brush um, and then you can just use a tiny little bit. So a little goes a long way. This is going to last me probably even next winter, honestly. I imagine this is going to last forever. So that's exciting. And then, oh, I wanted, I also wanted a lipstick that would be nice for winter. So something a little with a little more pop and I'm wearing it right now. It is by Bite, which is apparently, I think it's supposed to be Canadian. Go Canadians. Um, it's Canadian and it's also really organic. So this one is called Quince and it is, um, it's like a, a lipstick that, um, it's, it's supposed to stay really, really long. And you know what? It kind of does. Look at that. I don't know if you can see it well, but it's on me and I, I'm just in love with this. It's really, really nice lipstick. So I got those. I went crazy in Sephora and spent a pretty penny. I wanted um, a nude um, lipstick. And um, it's hard to find nude lipsticks as a blonde, I find, because you can just get washed out. Sometimes when you use a nude lipstick, you just look kind of dead. So I mostly like to do nudes with like a dark eye. But um, I found a um, lipstick that I actually do like. And it's kind of like a mix between um, a lipstick and a lip gloss, which I really like. It's called Revlon. Oh boy, I'm trying to remember what the actual title of it is called. Oh yeah, Revlon Color Burst Lip Butter. And this one is a uh, pink truffle. So you can see, I've used it, you can tell. Um, so I really, really like it. It's just, it's just really, here, sorry. It's really, really pretty. Pretty, pretty nude. Doesn't look as nude as, sorry, where's the camera? It doesn't really look as nude in the camera as it, as it is, it's quite nude. Uh, but it's like a pinky, it's like a pinky chocolate, which I kind of like. I haven't worn one of those in years. So I really like it. It keeps your lips really moisturized, which is so good. So I did that. And then this, this has changed my nighttime routine entirely. I love this thing. It's called um, the Lip Slip, um, and it's by Sarah Hap. Um, I went in to go and get a massage at my spa, and I saw this on the counter, and I was like, my lips are really parched. What is this stuff? And they said, oh, it's nice, like, just lip balm. And this is it. And it has changed my lips. I only use it once a day. I use it at night right before I go to bed. And I'm telling you, this stuff will completely solve if you have any sort of like dryness or, you know, in, especially in the winter, your lips can get chapped and stuff. This just, it's like a moisture surge. It's sticky, so you don't want to like, I don't like wearing it in the morning or anything. I like to have it at night um, and let it soak in. And even in the morning, I can, it's still on my lips. After eight hours, it's still on my lips. I absolutely love this stuff. I'm going to buy this again and again and again. So Sarah Hap, the lip slip. Get it? This one's so good. Oh my God. Tea. This is Celestial Seasonings Sleepy Time Vanilla Tea. And I put a little cup of tea on right before bed and I head up to bed with a book and it just is so soothing. It's just the most soothing tea in the world. I love this tea. They have all sorts of different kinds of sleepy time teas, but the vanilla tastes like vanilla and it's just calming. And if you if you're stressed out, you know, working a lot or whatever, or you just want to have a nice nighttime ritual, this is a wonderful thing to add to it. I really love it. 
makes me happy. Um, oh, so this next one that I have for you is um, a candle. I went to Chapters, which is like my second home basically, um, and I found this candle um, and it's called Wood Fire. Oh my God. It literally smells like, it smells like there's a fire going in the fireplace. It's, it's brilliant. I'm, I'm actually thinking right now I have it in my living room, but I just as I'm sitting here, I'm thinking of moving into my bedroom and putting this on with my sleepy time tea and like reading a book and just, just enjoying that scent. It's the most delicious scent in the world. And it comes in a cute little package too. It's nice, right? That's pretty. So, um, this one you can get at chapters. Uh, but it's actually not by chapters. It's by Illume, Illume wood fire. Anyway, smells exactly like that. If you don't have a fireplace, go get it. Now I'm really getting into like weight loss and health and wellness here. So I, my um, heart rate monitor died. The battery died. I could have replaced it, but I was like, you know, I think it's time to upgrade. I think it's time to invest. So I got the Polar FT60, I believe this one is. I think so. I think it's the Polar FT60 and it is pretty awesome. It tells you what range you're in, in terms of your heart rate, obviously, but what range it wants you to be in. If you want to lose weight, then it suggests go into like level one and level two to to uh, have fat loss. And it was very interesting using this because I found out that I have been in level three all the time, which is um, endurance. So I'm building my cardio um, and my heart is thanking me, but um, I wasn't burning as much fat. And it's hard for me to get out of it though. I like to work out in that in that intensity when I'm doing my cardio at least. Um, so what I've noticed is that in cardio, I'm in level three, which is the advanced. I'm working as hard as I possibly can and my endurance is getting better. And then um, I've been doing like half an hour of cardio and then I switch over to half an hour of um, strength training. I'm doing body beast right now, which is hilarious. It's like this big muscle guy and he's very He's a muscle guy, and I am not like that at all. So it's just amusing to me. But um, so I find that when I'm doing my strength training, I'll be burning um, fat. So I'm in level one and two. So this really keeps me on track in terms of that. And it's also so nice to see where you are in your calories. Um, I try to keep going until like I, I know that I've burned at least 500 calories. That's kind of my my goal all the time is to burn the, at least that. Um, so this really keeps you on track and keeps you going. I love it. It comes with a chest strap and I actually didn't buy a polar before because of the chest strap. I was like, that's going to be so annoying. It's going to fall off all the time. It doesn't. It never, it never falls off. Um, it's actually pretty awesome. So, um, don't, if you're worried about the chest strap, um, it, you really don't have to, it is secure. I put it right underneath, um, my sports bra, just like right, right below it and nothing, it's never fallen off. So that is good. And you can adjust it to make it tighter or looser or whatever you want. But I really, really recommend this heart rate monitor. Um, you don't have to go all out. They have different ranges polar. So, you know, it's up to you. Um, my latest, I don't know if you guys know, but I do turbo kick. Um, I recently went for an instructor training and I can now teach, which is amazing. I love that. I'm really excited. Um, and if you don't know what turbo kick is, it is kind of like dance meets kickboxing and the in the like inventor of turbo kick is Shailene Johnson and she's just like the most bubbly outgoing happy motivating person 
Um, so this is my soulmate workout. So they keep sending me rounds that I can teach. And the latest one came in, and this one is very sporty. And um, so it takes away some of the dance, and it's a little more sporty. Um, this killed me. The other night I, I tried it, and I was just like, I... It was so hard. I had to take so many breaks. So um, this is my latest turbo kick round. I love it. Um, so if you're not an instructor, um, you can get Turbo Fire, which is something that you can um, you can buy for at home. So I'm actually a Beachbody coach. So if you are interested in it, cl just click the link below. I'll put a little link there so that you can buy it from me. And, and we can also just talk about about your goals if you're interested in dance meets kickboxing this is my soulmate workout i think it's always going to be my soulmate workout i love this um so yeah if you're interested in doing something like turbo kick turbo fire is is basically turbo kick um the last thing that i have is kind of silly um it's just a snack that i i love these they're so delicious, Vita Tops. They're only 100 calories, and they literally, they taste like, they taste like a muffin. They're like the little muffin top, so they come in packages of four. They're only 100 calories, and I think they have, yeah, they have um, eight grams of fiber, which is awesome, and five grams of protein. So those are really nice. You, th you can find them in the freezer section of um, your grocery store. Um, it's usually near the Eggos for me for some reason. So bypass the Eggos, people, and go straight for the Vita Tops. They're delicious. So that, that was my haul. I hope that you liked it. And um, like this video if you want me to do more of these because I, I buy so many things. I should probably stop, but... It's, it's something that makes me happy and um, yeah, so if you like this video, uh, click like below um, and obviously comment if you have anything that you want me to do, um, any kind of videos that you'd like me to do. And uh, thank you guys for watching and we will chat soon. Okay, bye guys!